Okay, trying again with Judas. One of my favorite items we just picked up to start off, Serpent's Kiss. That's something with both offensive and defensive potential. So, let's see how it goes. Okay, I'm cornered by weak asses early on would help. Serpent's Kiss, of course, poisons enemies sometimes. Some of your tears do, not all of them. And if a poison enemy dies, then they have a fair chance of dropping a black heart. Which means what you'd really like to see is a lot of little enemies, little ass flies and stuff, because the more enemies you kill, the more black hearts you can get, just like this. And of course the poison does a little extra damage, it's not amazing, but it's some, and when you're getting that many black hearts, it doesn't matter too much how much your damage is. Not only are you got some protection from dying, when you lose one, of course it smashes the whole room up nicely. because I still need a boss rush victory and a hush victory. Oh, thought I had the room finished, honestly. Do I still not? There we are. It would be really nice just to see the Lord of Flies to start this off. That would be fantastic. is great when you've got certain items like Serpent's Kiss or Charm of the Vampire. It just gives you more stuff to kill to give you health. Oh well, I got hit. Oh no. <laughs> Look at that. And a moderate damage increasing item too. Overall, that's a Pretty solid starting floor. Mm, I don't have money or bombs to care too much about an arcade at this time, so we'll hold off on that. Oh, that sacrifice room has definite potential. Let's see how many black hearts we have accumulated by the end of this floor, and we might come back and do it. Mostly in the hope of getting some angel items to make other fights easier, but I'm going to want a pretty substantial collection around here. Unfortunately, getting a room eliminated with a black heart means you won't generate more black hearts because you've got to poison things for them to give them to you. Poisoned and dying isn't a guarantee of a heart. It might be 50 50, it might be less. It's a pretty decent chance, but not overwhelming. I could just wait for this guy to produce me a lot of spiders and get it that way, but he doesn't make them quite as fast as I'd like. Alright, let's see what our treasure room is. Harlequin Baby isn't bad, considering he does double shot, but as far as babies go, he's not awful, but he's also not the kind of thing that just wins you games on his own either. Come on, die. Darn it. No black hearts. And I went backwards into a room that I got skipped over earlier. I also don't believe the poison actually has to be active at the time they die. I just believe they have to have been poisoned at some point during their existence and die. And get the black heart. I could be mistaken on that, but I think that's how it works. Alright, come on, guys. Get poisoned and die. Well, you did, but you didn't give me my black heart. 
these guys have the potential to explode into a whole bunch of flies that have the potential to give me a whole bunch of hearts, and it's not working that way. They're the bomb kind. Oh, we got one there, though. It's still enough that it might be worth trying the sacrifice room, but I'm still gonna explore the rest of the floor and find out. Oh, if I could pick up a soul heart here, that'd be real nice. Oh, black candle, solid too, but we're gonna take the soul heart. And I, th you know what? I think I'm just gonna probably risk. I'll do the boss first, but then I'll probably go back and try the sacrifice room if I don't get my ass absolutely whooped here. I should, probably should have saved that too for sacrifice room. It would have helped me fight angels. Although I actually don't need to stay around to fight the angels either. Necessarily. Oh, How divorce papers is a nice help. And there's Dark Bum again. Do I take Dark Bum? Hmm. Oh man. You know what? I'm not gonna take Dark Bum this time just because. I'm kind of annoyed I got that bone heart this late in the game. At this point. If I'd done the sacrifice room first, I'd be able to carry this bone heart over, but oh well. My own poor judgment call. Let's go do it. Let's hope for an angel item or two. Truth time. It's not working out in my favor for this here. Seven. Nope. I could continue for the angels, but I'm just not going to. I have no need to fight him. I don't need the key. I don't need Mega Satan. Just gonna work on barreling through the remaining levels. Quickly, if I pick up an angel room later on, or some devil deals that I'm more interested in, that's great, but now I need some speed. Divorce Papers was nice enough to give me a little boost to my tears, so... That's an attack. Help. Okay, I'll remember that. Jerk ass. There's one. There's me getting hit and balancing out the fact that I just got a black heart. Although it must have eaten up that soul heart I had instead. I kind of forgot about that. I will trade two bombs for three bombs. Not much of a game, but well. nice, nice. Nice. Two black hearts out of that deal. With Curse of the Unknown, I can't keep track of exactly how many I have, but I can count. Gaining two without getting hit. Uh, no, Jawbone isn't top priority for me right now. Neither is that one. I've already got a good source of black hearts. Onk is not what I want right now. Oh, man. Just not. There's some okay items. In oh, well. Jeez. You know what? This is all kinds of overkill, but I'm. Once again, very difficult to kill now, since I can generate black hearts and make my own soul hearts. But Book of Belial is nice, but isn't amazing. I'm going to instead take a second book to increase my chance of the bookworm. If I do find another sacrifice room, that's a little more health I can have towards it, or 
wherever else I need it. Devil deals or angel rooms are now at their highest probability of happening. And I can also afford to spend red hearts on devil deals a little better now too. There's the shop. Not enough money to make much use out of it, but... One bomb I could try. I'm only gonna do it because... Also might get money from there. Oh god, two more coins would be fantastic. But I'm not gonna go searching around hard for them. Love PhD. But I'm not wasting my valuable time see if I can find two more coins to scrape up from the fire or something somewhere. Challenge room. A little behind schedule on getting to the boss rush. I'd like to correct that as best as possible. What do we got? Arg. No go and I'm not even gonna blow them up because I used up my bombs. I could obviously spend some hearts on them but I'm not going to. If I had bombs, I don't. And my most likely reward is soul hearts anyway, so not high priority right now. I can't even farm that to get into that gold chest right now. If it changes, I'll come back and do it. Serpent's Kiss is a huge help in the boss rush if I get to it and to fight Brownie because, or a couple other guys, because they generate so many little guys that are likely to turn into black hearts when they die that it makes me very hard to defeat there. Not worth screwing around for the four coins involved. around for a shop at this point. If it's not just handed right to me and easy. Wow, I'm really shocked I didn't get a single black heart from there. Not that I needed it, but just with that many enemies. Lots are usually pretty good that one will end up poisoned and paying off. What do we got here? Ooh, uh, uh, no. I don't like marked that much. I'm not going with it. Marked, of course, makes the... Kind of like Ludovico, makes the cursor for your targeting just float around separately, and your character automatically just perpetually shoots at that. I'd rather have these more normal tiers. Marked is tricky to use, right? And I just don't want to. Oh, but now Chaos... I'm probably gonna go with, just because Chaos is fun. Sure, no goblin. I'm gonna take Chaos, and we'll see what happens. That might not be a smart move, but it's got the potential to be all kinds of interesting. Or both powerful or weak. This is where I'll usually end up getting angel rooms and now because of chaos I just have a damn breakfast inside of them or something. But also I could get godhead from a boss room or anywhere else too. I think Chad is still gonna spit out his stupid baby Chad. I'm not 100% sure on that but fairly sure. I got six minutes or so left to do two floors, which means we're definitely gonna closer to seven minutes, I guess, but we're definitely gonna wanna be about speed here. Not a lot of messing around. Well, I'm playing, come on! That's where I get the slower. <sighs> I made it. up the bone 
hurt, which I would love. I have to get myself hurt just to do that. I'm definitely going in there to get bombs, especially gold bomb. What do we got here? Yeah. Smart fly. Again, for boss rush, he could be okay because if I get hit, I believe he'll stay active for the entire room. Yeah, I'm taking that hit on purpose, honestly. Just because I want to carry this bone heart around with me. And you know what? Not gonna... No, I'm not gonna look for the shop right now. Maybe I should, but based on the time, I'm not going to. real substantial way other than a couple little poison items. Oh, PhD now though. Well then. That's a nice thing to have one of those. I can see forever. Sure, I'll take I can see forever. I've got a little time to spare. Let me go on a secret room hunt and find the shop both in one and maybe that'll pay off in my favor. If I start taking too much time, though, I will run back. I don't have a ton of it to spare, but I got a few minutes. Okay. 
Okay, gotten it way too close for my liking. Just keep going as far as I can and hope that farther away means more likely to find the boss room. Time hopes at all. Come on, smart fly. Go kill those things faster for daddy. Not even stopping for that. If I had more bombs, I would actually be exploding my way out of these rooms, but. Oh, crap, I am going to still blow my way out of this room. A bit of a risk inherent in that, but. I might not make the boss rush. All that. I think I should not have wasted that time on the previous floor. I'm gonna still stick my head into the treasure room because at that point. <sighs> Blank card. Okay, well. Now we're just taking a shot in the dark. And again, throwing a bomb. Oh, I might make it. It's gonna be close, but I might be able to pull it off. Suicidal to hurry though, but I'm okay with that. And I don't have so much firepower that I'm guaranteed this way either. So you know what? I actually might want to get stomped a few times. I'm trying to get a lump of meat in there as much as I can. Come on! I'm literally letting myself get stomped so that I can kill her faster. Oh my god, you're kidding me. It's close, I'm willing to cut this. And in. Okay. And I'm just going to take the straight up damage. The ceremonial robes. We're going right into the fight, which I didn't need to do. I guess I could have paused a little bit there now. But. I made it safely. Some more hearts. Got enough offense to have a decent chance at this. Of course, the more little guys like you that want to die and give me black hearts would be great. I don't think I killed Mega Thaddy, did I? Where the hell is he? Oh, it's not Mega Thaddy. Chasing around the death thing. Ah. Oh. Weave of relief now by making it into the boss rush with two seconds to spare. I even got risky going into the angel room, but worked out okay. Guppy's tail is not a bad item at all, and picked up another soul heart while I was in. Wow, my timing is off. I know he's going to shoot me in. I thought I'm timing for it, but I'm actually screwing it up. Give me something. Give me a Lord of the Flies. Something that makes lots of little guys. I'll spend a minute killing them to get these black hearts up in here. These aren't good enough. Oh, especially if I'm going to just run into them like a dummy. Lots of red hearts. Red hearts are not black hearts, though, guys. It's a little more dangerous if you grab a red heart at the last minute later on. Make it down to one. Blast assist is a decent enough enemy that might give me a black heart or two. Especially if I keep standing in front of them like that. Need them. There we go. A couple. There we go. Three. That's nice. Gertie can also generate some from his all his flies and stuff, so I might take him out second, give him a chance to generate little guys for me while I fight this jerk first. Oh, I can't for the life of me remember if he can brimstone me or not. I'm sure I'll find out soon if he does. Oh! Smart 
Gadfly went and killed Gertie for me. That was a nice one. Ow. Getting smashed, man. I love the habit right now, the way I'm getting hit. My dodging has not been up to par today. My reflexes feel a little, uh, slow. some of those angel shots so far. Oh, I don't like Forsaken. Let's get him killed as soon as we can. See a couple black hearts lying around. That's good news. It's much harder to kill this time than I was last time I tried boss rush. I'm... Once I get some mapping and get really lucky though, I'm not going to have the speed to then make it to hush. But hey, one out of the two ain't bad, and I've got the negative because I still need to do the lamb and uh, Satan. Definitely still things here to be gained. want to jump on me. I'm not inclined to let that happen. Like Pete just straight up die. First, here we go. Guess you can be next. I've got to be getting towards the tail end of this boss rush by now. I haven't been keeping count, but I'm sure I'm over the halfway mark anyway. wants to throw me a great item too at the end of it that'd be really nice I was right the smart fly will steal for the whole room his damage has been welcome played it over what the hell was that other thing oh the widow how the hell did something hit me so fast what is widow throwing at me those spiders are getting a lot of distance Cephalus, whatever the hell your name is, you can just die as quickly as possible, thank you. I see the black heart holding off on it for now, because well, I'm only down half a heart. No reason to not be efficient. Okay, wow. Big damn deal, we put bombs in your bombs. I mean, I'll take it, but... Definitely don't see me having the time to get to Hush without some miracle mapping and even then me absolutely hauling ass. I don't I got some power from getting those robes, but not enough to just blaze through rooms without much effort. Oh, Blackheart's helping me out again. Hits. Could use a wafer right now too, but that's a lot to ask for. That's only because I seem to suck at dodging today. I don't know why, but something is just off with me on this. Come on, buddy, where'd you go? Last one. There you are. Okay. Oh. That one didn't try to dodge, I just thought it was gonna miss. Oh yeah, scatter bombs, damn it! Every time, the first time I get scatter bombs, I forget I have them, and then. Uh, I probably should have just not taken them, honestly. I end up hurting myself. 
piss off the scatter bombs more than they're any use a lot of the time. safe as I thought I'd be this game because I'm just bad at the game today. Whew, got him. Okay. Get that heart back. Let's see some more drugs around here too since I got PhD. Try my luck that a lot of rocks might give me a um, small rock or something. Didn't happen. Oh, good. There's the boss room at least, so we can minimize how many more times I get hit on my way out this level. Still would be a small miracle to get to hush. I'd pretty much have to land on top of the boss room. Next floor. Conquest for giving me all those targets. Conquest still gives the pony. The white pony specifically, sorry. Okay. One minute, so if I knew where the boss room was, I'd have a chance. As is probably not. I'm making it there under 30 minutes so that I could try on hush. That is a very good chance of making it successfully to the boss room eventually. I'm getting hit more than I want. Like a lot more than I want. Yeah, there's really no point in rushing now. There is zero way I'm going to be able to make it to hush in time. So, play a little safer and smarter, hopefully. Comparatively, at least. Since I haven't been very safe or smart this whole run. Maybe because I'm not I don't feel in danger since I can generate black hearts so well. Even though I'm still getting less of them lately than I thought I would. I'm not seeing my poison shot very often. There we go, it's nice though. Book of Revelation and a battery. Two new soul hearts to add to the list. Black heart sitting right down there. one. The devil. The devil is uh, decent enough. I'm going to be happy taking the devil into boss fights. Good trade there. Got hit once. Got a black heart back. Another one up there. You'd hope that some of them have items in them for chaos to pay off and give me something cool, but no. So I haven't seen a devil room in a while. A good chance of getting one this time, even though it won't be devil items. Or angel items for that matter. Could get that too. One makes you larger. I'm not going to play that game. Myself getting cornered there. Still came out ahead overall. Where are you, jerk? Miss 
missing poster. I'm not taking missing poster over the nose goblin. Not the nose goblin's great, but I have no need for the missing poster. <laughs> no need for those either. Okay, easy kill. Almost a pointless room there. And I don't think any of those are explodable rocks, although it's harder to tell. Not doing that. Not when I screwed with the reward pool so that even if I got angel items, they wouldn't be guaranteed to actually be angel items. Okay, and here we go. It lives. Hopefully I can be a little smarter against it lives than I have been most of my other fights so far. Dodging has been a little better th thus far. Them, so negative double checked going on disappointed there wasn't a devil or angel room there curse of the blind curse of the blind with chaos so it's a good thing there probably won't be any items given to me god only knows what I could get there oh look at that whatever bomby bomb that was probably a dumb thing to do but only a couple items that could be bad, and the pool's actually been changed so much it was even less likely for me to get them. Ha! I did not run into my scatter bombs that time. I should have taken that battery. Soul heart. I'll see it now, even though I've got two charges on the battery. Oh, look at that. Yeah, we are absolutely not screwing around here. We're going to Satan and getting the hell out. I could have farmed those guys for a bit for the last two black hearts, but I just don't want to. here. Sorry for that pause, I'm not editing it out. Delivery guy just showed up. my rhythm. Oh, and got a black heart back. And there we go, he's dead. Moving along. And here we go, 
find oh curse of the blind again great I was about to say I'm waiting for a teleport to take me here so whatever let's try my luck wire coat hanger actually that's a decent item cost me my only red heart but tears went way up so that's good we'll blow up the uh, thing and hope for some good drugs I'm drowsy is not the worst thing. Why? I'm drowsy coming two different colors <sighs> okay whatever moving along don't know why don't want to figure it out come on guys that's lots of little guys black hearts again would be nice Come on, there's one. No matter what, we pulled one out of that. If we don't get hurt, that's a, that's a gain. I don't know why I'm saying if we don't get hurt, because it's really just me. Even if you're rooting for me, I'm the only one with any control over this guy right now. Okay going as far away from the opening room as I can in the rough theory that the boss is in that direction. I am shocked none of those hit me. There we go. There was one. None of those dropped a black heart. And now I just brought myself in a big little circle. Probably not the direction of the boss. Drowsy pill at this point, too. Since I have apparently two more back in the starting room, but. Saving for something a little harder than this. Even though I did just take damage. Sure, dead dove. Uh, flight and spectral tears. Okay. Nothing wrong with that overall might not make a big impact at this point in the game, but never know. Might be somewhere where I could use flight to gain something in a room somewhere. Spectral tears won't help for the boss fight, but I could in regular rooms up till there. Red hearts don't do me a lick of good. I'm going to use I'm Drowsy on this one just because there's going to be so many of these downsides going around for a while. And because, like I said, I have more of these pills back where I started. And again, it'd be nice if you guys would manage to just die and leave me a black heart, though. Better. There's one. We got Jera. Okay. That could get used, depending. That'd be good to use in a room where I end up having, you know, three black hearts left in the ground. If one of those happens to develop. Kill your own guys before I can do it. That's not going to help me, though, buddy. Sure, why not? Rune bag. Not so many not many rooms left for that to work in, but what the hell? Game breaking bug. That'd be great if I had a shovel. I don't. Cornered a lot there. pill for another one of these fights. Oh well. Now will these hit everybody? Well, let's keep going. Crooked Penny, you're not 
touching the crooked penny right now. Man. Where's a nice random godhead when you need one? Which normally wouldn't be possible, but... With chaos, in effect, it is. And why are none of you tears coming out poisoned? This could theoretically have given me a whole ton of black hearts if I would have shot some poison tears, but I've shot almost none, and it didn't work. Well, I'm right. Uh, you know what? We're just going to go for it. If I fail, I fail. Try not to. Oh, I should have went back and grabbed the drowsy pill, though. That was dumb. Now I'm going to... I'm going to deserve to die. If I do, when I inevitably do, since I'm so close to it. I should have went back and grabbed the drowsy pill. It was plain stupidity not to. Me just getting a little impatient. And it's going to cost me. Oh yeah, great. Yeah, great. That's exactly what I needed. Thanks. Oh my god, I survived. Holy crap, yeah, no victory lap. That barely counts as a victory. I'm just going to get in the chest and get the hell out of here. Alright, so, ugly, ugly victory. Should have went better, but I suck. We're good. Just ultra greedier and hush left to go. So, hope you enjoyed that one. That was at least a win.